what's up youtube i'm not t mac back with another video and in today's video we are going to be going over the top coaches in nba 2k21 my team if you're new to the channel make sure you sub drop a like um and comment on your thoughts what you think the best coach in the game is or what coach you're using so let's go ahead and get into the video um right here on the screen y'all can see this is going to be the fifth best coach in the game to me um mike budenhoser we're gonna do top five so from worst to best so this is number five mike budenhoser um and he's defense um y'all can see the positive and the negatives he brings let's click on him see what he gives to our players um plus fives and everything because he is a diamond coach plus five perimeter d plus five lateral quickness plus five help plus five block plus five strength um yeah he's pretty self-explanatory gives plus fives to everything basically defense and honestly the only downside to him is that he doesn't give any any offensive boost whatsoever so if you feel like you're you don't really need help on offense or you know you just need defensive help this Mike Boonhoes are really come in handy because the plus fives to almost everything in defense will really help you out. Okay, guys, so moving on to number four on our list, we have Billy Donovan, who is a grit and grind coach. Y'all can see the positives and the negatives for him. Um, let's go ahead and click on him. So he has an amethyst coach. He gives plus fours. Let's go to my point guard. Plus four three, plus four lateral quickness, um, plus four help D, plus four pass IQ, plus four perimeter D, and plus four steal for my point guard. And shooting guard is similar to point guard, um, small four. But see, the drop off comes to the power forward and center position. He actually doesn't boost their three point shot. Is it just the three point shot? Yeah, I think it's just three-point shot and lateral quickness he doesn't boost. So, for them, he's basically just giving them defense. But for your one through three, he's giving them defense and, you know, three-point shot, layup. He's giving you a lot. So, at number four on the list, Billy Donovan, I feel like he's slightly better than Budenhoser because he gives the defense and the offense to your one through three but he does like giving that offense to your four and five position. So let's go ahead and move on to number, oops, I just backed out. Number three on the list. And who would I say is number three? I'm gonna go Nick Nurse, man. Nick Nurse, number three on my list. Um, I know a lot of y'all might not agree with me, because he does give plus fives and he is balanced. So let's go ahead and click on him, see what he gives. Plus five driving layup, plus five close shot, plus five mid range, plus five defense, plus five ball handle, and plus five three point shot. Um, He does give plus five perimeter D, plus five three point shot. Those are the main two things that I think pretty much everybody is focusing on um but the thing with him is he doesn't give the three ball to the power four or the center position and that that that's what really hurts this nick nurse card to me so one through three he gives defense and three point shot he's kind of like uh billy donovan in a way Honestly, they both give the same boost, but Nick Nick Nurse's boosts are just slightly better with that plus five instead of that plus four. So this is Nick Nurse at number three for me. And let's move to I keep backing out. Let's go ahead and move to number two. And this this might shock a lot of people. I don't know if y'all gonna be able to guess who's at number two. But at number two, I got to go with Mike Malone, man. Mike Malone, patient space coach, 
Y'all see the positives, y'all see the negatives. But look, wait until I click on them, okay? Y'all gonna just hear me out. Look, now look what he gives. Plus three three-point shot. Plus three speed and plus three perimeter defense. Now, with him giving plus three speed and plus three three and plus three perimeter D, nobody else gives speed that I just named. None of those other coaches that I put after Mike Malone, none of them gave speed. They gave the three ball, they gave the perimeter D, but they might have been plus four, plus five, but they didn't give the speed. So I have him at number two because he actually gives the speed with the three ball and the perimeter defense, even though it's only plus three. And everybody on your team gets the speed. They get the um they get the perimeter defense. And the only downside is that he doesn't give the three ball to um to your centers. So your one through four position, they get the three ball, they get perimeter D, and they get speed. But your five, they only get perimeter, interior D, and speed. But the speed boost, that that's really the main thing that I think everybody should be looking for in a coach. And and he's he's the least expensive out of all the coaches I just named. I think he's less than 5K. So I think, yeah, he's he's the best bang for your buck out of all the coaches. So at number two, we got Mike Malone. And at number one, I'm pretty sure everybody already knows who's at number one. It's really no debate in it. Seven seconds, Mike D'Antoni. So he's an amethyst coach. Um, as y'all can see, he gets plus four speed, plus four three to my players. And yeah, but the he doesn't really give anything on the defensive end. But from a coach, do you really need defense? I don't know. Some players would say not. Some players would say they do. It's honestly personal preference. Personally, my favorite coach in the game is Mike Malone because he gives the, the speed, the three, and the defense. But I think Mike D'Antoni to most people who play this game is a little bit better because he does give the plus four to speed instead of plus three and plus four to three ball. And he gives the speed and the three ball to to each position. So you're not missing out on the center with Mike D'Antoni as you would with Mike Malone, per se. So this is my top five. Um, at number one, we got Mike D'Antoni. I keep backing out. I don't know why I keep backing out. So number one, we got D'Antoni. Number two, we got Mike Malone. Uh, number three, Nick Nurse. Number four, Billy Donovan. And number five, Mike Budenholzer. So though these are the best coaches in NBA 2K21, my team. If y'all did enjoy this video, please drop a like, subscribe. Um, comment y'all thoughts on who the best coach is in the game and I will see y'all next video. Peace.